men were standing in the pouring rain, and you came by and had only two umbrellas to give, what would you do? Keep one for yourself and throw the other one away. <laughs> <laughs> and why exactly, Chase, would you do that? Well, you certainly don't deserve to get wet. And if these men are dumb enough to just be sitting there in the rain, not even trying to find shelter, I don't see why they deserve one in the first place. What good would an umbrella do for anyone? They'd still all get wet anyways. Jean, that's rather pressing. As for you, Chase, what kind of philosophy is that? Do you really want to live in a society where, if you couldn't get out, figure out how to get out of the rain, no one helped you out, even if they had nothing to lose by? John, this is stupid. We're not here for another one of your physical debates. Good point. Why are we here? What does it all mean? Where are we going? Philosophical, by the way. What? Philosophical. You meant philosophical. I thought that's what I said. No, you said physical. I heard philosophical. Me too. <laughs> no. It doesn't matter what any of you heard. Oh, there you go again, Robert. What's the matter today? Nothing that isn't the matter every day. Oh, and cynical. Lovely. Well, I like my men like that. <laughs> what, Victoria? Yes? No, I mean, what did you say? Doesn't matter what she said. What matters is that I think we're wasting time. Time for doing what, Margaret? I'm rather enjoying this conversation. It's kind of like the philosopher meets the cynic meets the whore. No offense, Victoria. And then the cynic realizes that some people have a sense of humor and fears his whole life is undone. None taken, since I assume by whore you meant yourself. Oh dear, stop it, you guys. Yes, please stop. What's the matter with you, Victoria and Chase? You're both in bad moods and not funny. I think they're funny. Who even are you? I don't know. Who I've always been. Oh dear, two cryptics? This is smashing fun. No one says smashing, dear. Or do they say dear in that way, come to think of it? This is absolutely one of the strangest conversations I've ever been in. Funny, since it's you who's making it strange. Oh, maybe it's not my strangeness, but your weird selves distorting my normality. <laughs> I really don't see how that makes sense. <laughs> well, it does. Just think about it. You know, I've been thinking... And therefore existing. Good. <laughs> Finally, someone brings up Descartes. <laughs> okay, John, you're clearly a smart person. I get that. So let's talk for a moment. Everyone about needs to please shut up. Why are we all fighting? You're the most belligerent of all of us. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, guys, this conversation is going to hell. Not the negative afterlife, like complete bad badness, I mean. I've been thinking that... Uh, stop! I just really think we all need to take a moment to remember that we're all friends who love each other really much, and that this is stupid to be fighting. Just remember what Jesus said, okay? Shut up! Do you really want to know why I'm having a bad day? Because this sucks. <laughs> if this is what our lives are like, this sucks. I can think- I hate you all! <laughs> this situation is so out of balance. <laughs> For once in my life, I agree. What is it, Rebecca? Well, I was thinking... Yes? Well, when Margaret asked me who I was, I don't really know. Ah, Emerson would be so pleased. He thought that. No, not like that. Not as in I don't know my true self. I don't know who I am. What? Who am I? I mean, you're Rebecca. Is that all I am? Is I mean... Name? I mean, no. Then what? I need to go. <laughs> Wait, what? I just... I need to go. Okay, bye? Bye. Where's Christy? She'd make everything better. Christy's coming. She said so. Look, guys, I'm really sorry for the crappiness of this conversation. I just... Christy would make everything better. Christy is not coming. <laughs> what? You heard me. She's not coming. Okay, you need to cut it out. She's not coming. No one's coming. Nothing is coming. Have you figured that out yet? <laughs> Apparently not. All the better. Oh. <laughs> uh, a Lovecraftian. The most merciful thing in the world, I think, is the inability of the human mind to correlate its
contents. We live as specks in the midst of black seas of infinity, and it is not meant that we should voyage far. Science. Enough! Leave now, John. You're not a philosopher. You just know what the philosopher said. That's not a philosopher, that's an anti-philosopher. And you're just going to ruin us all with your fake philosophy. Get out! All right, I'm going. Not fast enough. <laughs> I know. You need to go think about who you are. <laughs> you already know the answer. It's just a matter of believing it. I... Thanks. No problem. <laughs> <laughs> so you've driven everyone away, Victoria. Feel happy about yourself? You should go too, Margaret. You're a good person. This was just a bad day. A bad dream. It won't have an impact on our future. I don't think so. Everyone loves you, Margaret. Okay. All right. Goodbye, guys. See you tomorrow. Or whenever is next. Bye. I'm sorry. It's okay, darling. I know you just want them to go away. I love you. I just, I love you more than I could ever say. I wanted to be with you. Even if it all means nothing. Even if it is nothing, I just wanted to be with you. I love you. Just next time, try to let the others enjoy existing for a bit longer. This play was going to be short anyways. They were only going to hurt each other more. I know. They almost realized, though, that this is a theater and that they're just play beings. Rebecca began to realize all the holes in her existence. All she is is a name and a collection of actions. All of us are that. We're so... Empty. You shouldn't plan ideas like that in your head. Your fears are your own. Don't lay them on others. It would make her suffer. What does it matter if she suffers? We all suffer. And it's all meaningless in the end. She's a good girl. Don't cause her any more pain than she'll already have to endure. Is what John talked about true? About us being specks of infinity? Yeah, that No, you know that. I just don't know. Will Christy ever get here? She always comes, my soul. She always comes. Just a little longer. Not now, though. I love you. And I love you. Is there not enough meaning in that for a thousand universes? Yes. I love you. I love you.